hello it's Kel here so today I'm gonna show you how you can replace the battery of the laptop Lenovo idea pad 114 IBD okay so first you should have your laptop you can flip at the back so that you can unscrew the screw and it should have some tools with you for opening it and it should have a battery this is a new battery i received it today so let me show you first how it looks like so this is a new one so this is the one that we're gonna replace with the old one here so stay tuned i'll show you step by step how to put the new one and remove the old one okay first you should grab your tool and then you should start to open the screw now we're gonna flip like this and remove our screws check just a little bit so we see we have the screw that came out from the laptop and put it aside or somewhere that you will never lose it okay I'm gonna put somewhere Okay, so we double check if there is the remain screw. Oh, nothing. Okay, so first, before you remove the cover, you should remove the place that you put the CD or DVD like this. So you remove this first, put it aside okay and then you're gonna remove the cover make sure you there is no any other screw somewhere okay now we remove it and remember there are this connection here you should remove it first as you can see there That's a connection. Let's connect the battery with the with this cover. Okay, so now we're gonna open it. The bed, the screw that hold the battery. there it's removed this side too okay after you unscrew the battery screw here I have to disconnect this but to disconnect this you open this and then um, we're gonna open the keypad area to get access of the connection okay so we're gonna find something to pop up this and then now we can gonna be easy to be removed okay lastly we remove it and we get the access here this is the connection 
this connection for keypad can try to clean up if uh, having some dating inside can take maybe a tissue we're gonna remove the bed connector and then we push it out yeah like that so our new one is gonna be like this push it here to the connector not this way okay yeah you have to notice that there is an arrow showing we can fold it like this and can flip and remove the battery Here we are now, so you can remove easily because we remove the screw that hold the battery. Yeah, like that. So now we're gonna put the new one like that. Put it there. And then make sure your wire cannot just be cut by the plastic there so we're gonna put the two screw first one there and another one here and then we screw it ready cannot be moved looks so good this way and then we check if there are some dating yeah still have so we clean it put it back put there and then we flip it again set down That. and then we're gonna put there okay. after that we're gonna flip it But first of all, we have to close and then flip it upside down and then you're going to put the screw of this cover here. Make sure everything is okay. CD driver. So now it's time for putting the screw back. First of all, make sure the connector is in its right position over there. And then you can connect this keypad connector. So we take our keypad, this one, it's like this, it's clean. And then we connect first. So we're gonna put this over there. And then we gonna connect it. Okay. It's very easy. Then put it back to 
Okay, splash. Okay, here we are now. Everything is in place. And then we try to switch on back to see if, wow, it's working. So this is a new battery. So our battery is okay. So this is how you can replace your battery. After that, we're gonna put the charger to charge the battery for a few hours. And then when it's full, we can continue use the laptop. Thank you so much for watching my video. If this video is helpful, don't forget to subscribe. See you to the next one.